currently packing for Busan. I have a train to catch at 12 p.m. So I have about an hour and uh, I'm going with Jem. So we're gonna go and enjoy the Busan weather and a lot of the Busan food. Um, and before we get started, I wanted to introduce to you guys our sponsor, Beauty of Chosan. This is a brand that featured in a vlog before and a lot of you guys had really great things to say about the brand. And I've been using it for over a month and a half now. And I do really love the product. As you guys can see, I used up a lot of it. And I tried filming a monthly update, but to be honest with you, I feel like that would bore you guys out so much because I'm just talking about skin care for like 20 minutes each day so I thought you know what I'm just gonna give you guys a wrap up of what I think about the products and share with you my favorite products from the brand so you guys will find out later on in this video um, but the reason why I'm starting here is because I wanted to show you guys um, some of my travel skincare essentials because every time I went to Jeju a lot of you guys had questions about where I got this bag and some of like my favorite sunscreens and whatnot so we'll start with this so this pouch was a PR gift. I get questions about this every single time and it's very convenient because it fits a lot of my skincare products. Um, and then of course, can't forget the sunscreen. This is from Clarins. I really like this because it's in spray form. So it's very easy to apply, reapply sunscreen when you're at the beach or by the pool. So this is great and it smells really good. And then for the other two sunscreens, I like to layer two from Troyotic. Okay, the UV protector essence and then follow up with the intense UV protector cream. So I have three sunscreens in here. Can't forget toothbrush and toothpaste. I have a bunch of these at home because every time I go to a hotel and when I remember to take my toothbrush, I end up not using the one at the hotel and I just bring it home. And so I have a bunch of these. Foam toner and the essence. These two are products that I have been loving from Beauty of Chosan. Um, we'll share more about it later on. My deodorant, I should use some right now. <laughs> this I did a video for earlier too, but I just love how this one smells and it really glides on so smoothly. Um, this is an eye makeup remover from Dear Dahlia. I feel like I've been using this forever now because I don't wear as much eye makeup as I used to because um, I'm just home all the time, but I'm just gonna take this in case. I have a little pouch that I received from Glow Recipe. They had samples in here and I just use it for my Q-tips and cotton pads. Troy Attica Oil Cut Cleanser and TOC Toner. Can't forget this summer essential, mosquitoes are back. And this is a gel, I think I bought this in Jakarta or Malaysia. I don't really remember, but, oh, Indonesia. I bought this in Indonesia and I still use it. It's great for treating mosquito bites. It's really quick. Um, and then here we have the BB grooming cream from Bumble and Bumble. I really like this because um, I have baby hairs and it kind of helps set them down. So this is like one of my go-tos. We have two new Beauty of Chosen products. We have the Glow Deep Serum and the Radiance Cleansing Balm. These are the two products that we'll be giving away as well. So stay tuned for more details um, throughout this vlog. I have a sheet mask from Beauty of Chosen and then um, we have the serum as well as the cream. I'm probably gonna be the designated skincare girl as always, um, but yeah, this cream is very nice and lightweight. And then I really love the repair serum. A lot of you guys commented on this product as well as the Essence and Dynasty cream as your guys' picks. And I have sensitive skin and so far, like I haven't had any problems with it. So I've been using a lot of Beauty of Chosan um, the past, month and a half so yes i really love the brand and i did film like a first impression so i'm going to insert this here because um some of you guys might enjoy first impressions and you'll see the products um like all filled up and i have blonde hair as well i just don't want to delete that because sometimes people like watching first impressions um, but if you don't like first impressions feel free to skip to this part Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Joan Day. Today's episode is another monthly, maybe a little over a month 
update. I have no idea because I'm gonna be reviewing a brand of skincare products and I actually have never tried it out but I unboxed it in a previous episode and a lot of you guys had some really good things to say about it. So this video is sponsored by Beauty of Chulsan. Um, I did ask them to test out the products before officially making a video so depending on whether I like the brand or not, this clip might not even make it to the vlog. Like I might just scrap the whole thing, but I'm really hoping that I like the products on my skin. And they sent me all of their serums, their peeling gel, their dynasty cream, as well as the essence water and bubble toner. And one sheet mask as well. They also sent me a little um, fabric envelope with the description of their products. On the first card they wrote me a nice letter and on the second we have an explanation of their brand. So Beauty of Chosun is a brand that has reinterpreted the unchanging beauty and traditional Korean skincare methods from nature within a modern way. So the beginning of this vlog will be first impressions and first impressions, um, I like watching first impressions but at the same time I do love the follow-up reviews so you guys will be definitely getting that from me. So okay first we have the Chosun Minya Changmeshil Bubble Toner. Changmeshil, so green plum and AHA. It looks like this. This product is supposed to help soften and exfoliate dead skin cells and give skin vitality. So let's give this a try. I read up on this online and a lot of people use a cotton pad. So I'm just going to test it out on a cotton pad first. So it looks like this. This is a toner, a bubble toner. Never tried a bubble toner. All right, so here is the, oh my gosh, it feels very, very interesting. Wow, it really removed the dust on my face. I'm not gonna show you this because it's a bit disgusting, but my skin feels very clean and feels nice and plump actually. So, so far so good, but we don't know that. Um, here is the ginseng essence water and this is supposed to help moisturize brighten and soothe the skin and also has anti-aging um so i feel like i see a lot of essence waters that are formulated with ginseng or green tea and uh, those are the ones i tend to like the most if you guys watch my channel this product is supposed to promote circulation and collagen production to reduce the appearance of wrinkles and brighten skin. Ginseng is also anti-inflammatory, which provides calming effects. Niacinamide is great for oil control and improves texture by shrinking the appearance of pores over time with its hydrating properties. So let's give this product a go. All right. This is a total first impression, you guys. This is a very rare moment here on Joan Day because usually I like to, um, I don't really film a lot of first impressions, but okay. There's like no fragrance. Oh, oh, slightly, but here we go. We're just going to pat it onto the skin. Ooh, I really like how watery it is, but it absorbs quite quickly. So you can see that instant glow really nice. And then I'm gonna follow up with a product that a lot of you guys said good things about. It is the Repair Serum. And then when I was looking into this product, I noticed that there were a lot of reviews on this. This is the Repair Serum with Ginseng and Snail Mucin, um, kind of like this essence water. Um, ginseng is an ingredient that I do talk about quite often because it is a very precious ingredient here in Korea. Um, during Chuseok or Seollal, we usually give family members ginseng, um, like an actual ginseng root, or um, there's like this han hanyak that with ginseng in it. So, yeah, I know how precious ginseng is. There's also snail mucin, which is an ingredient that really helped fade my acne scars. So that's basically what this is going to do. Um, there's anti-aging, antioxidants, nourishing, anti-pigmentation, which is something that I do have. If you look up close, you could definitely 
definitely see it. My skin has gotten so much better over the years because I do take really good care of it. Um, but yeah, let me try this serum out. They also sent the glow serum as well as the calming serum. But knowing me, I love my repair serums. So here we go. This is what the product looks like. We're just going to apply a little bit. Ooh, there's 임상수 63.36. Oh, wow. So there's 63.36 ginseng and 3.01% snail mucin. 가함유되어 피부에 수분과 영양을 공급합니다. So moisture and um, 영양, what do you call that? Vitamins or what would you call that? Oh, like it's supposed to help with elasticity. I had the English translation right here. I don't know why I tried to translate that. Okay, here we go. Here is what it looks like. Oh, it's very, very nice. Oh, okay. Let's apply this. Hmm, so far I really like how the fragrance isn't as powerful. Usually with a lot of ginseng skincare products, I do notice that um, it has a strong scent. I know not everyone loves it. I personally don't mind it, but um, yeah, if you don't want a strong, I guess ginseng product, maybe this will be something that you would want to try, but I will give you guys updates on that throughout this vlog. All right, so after this, I am going to apply a cream and then let's go with the dynasty cream because this is the one that they sent over and i also noticed a lot of people really like this cream for sensitive acne prone skin and they liked how um silky smooth it was so yeah this is supposed to moisturize brighten smooth and also has anti-aging properties so the Hanbang Rice Bran Water Ginseng Root Water. There's a lot of ginseng in this line, I'm seeing. Um, there's also niacinamide in here, ceramide. So, okay, let me quickly give this one a go. With moisturizers, I'm very picky because I do have dry skin. It may look like I don't have dry skin, but it's because I apply a lot of product in order for me to get that glow. So this is, oh wow. It's in this little, it's like hanji, the Korean paper. And then when you open it up, we have the Dynasty Cream. And then this is what it looks like. Mm. Again, the fragrance is very, I don't even think this one has a fragrance. Wow, I like this one. Ooh, it's just so smooth. Do you see that? I'm staying home today, but I'm just applying this because I want to look nice for you guys. <laughs> okay. All right. So my first impression of all of these products, um, I like how it feels on the skin and I will definitely give you guys updates on whether it breaks me out or not. But I don't know, looking at the ingredients and how gentle it felt on my skin, I don't think it will, but we'll see. This is why I'm doing like a lengthy update on these products and share vlogs in between. So thank you guys for watching the first impressions and I'll catch up with you guys next time. All right, skin care is seriously half of my luggage each time like wherever I go and even if it's like a day trip the amount of products that I take is always gonna be the same so yeah that's why I always have a lot of stuff <laughs>
yeah, I really like them. And then I have my jewelry and bag is from Pisque again. And I have my Gentle Monster sunglasses in Linda. These are my favorite pair this summer. I've been wearing them nonstop. All right, let's wear a mask and then head over to KTX. Right, right. Head up with Dan. Having lunch before we take the KTX. KTX. You got a bulgogi? We're sort of twinning right now. Yeah. <laughs> right? All right, let's go, go, go. Um, I actually don't have a hashtag album for Busan, for Joan Food in Busan. Yeah. It's time to get it started. Look at this. Love that. So this is like their signature brownie and it's supposed to be spicy guys. <laughs> to dinner um, we actually parked our bags here and here we are they're here <laughs> it's here oh my gosh yeah we're in line for this place yes in and I'm obsessed with this bathroom <laughs> um, one of the reasons why I wanted to stay at the Grand Chozon is because of beauty of Chozon and I also thought it would be really nice to film a skincare routine here like this bathroom is just goals and then when you head on out we are greeted <laughs> why are you hiding? <laughs> we are greeted with um, two beds and then a nice view of the city. What are you doing? <laughs> oh my gosh, so funny. Yeah, this is our view for the next two days. Oh my gosh, these are these are nice. Really? Yeah, these the are the same really... ones. Because we Jeju is so cool. Ah, Yeah. Shall we unpack and make ourselves at home? <laughs> Ourselves home! <laughs> socks. Oh, other socks. Is it in your shoe? Maybe. Oh, or you threw it somewhere. <laughs> I don't care. Okay. okay. Let's see. Alright, let's unpack now. My biggest thing every time I go to a hotel is I 
like, I need to get the beauty station down. <laughs> you know, Mata? I always have to set that up. That's what you always do. <laughs> Oh, yes. Did you bring a lot of skincare? I know. You did it. Gotta take my meds. I'm getting an allergic reaction. I can't even talk. I'm getting an allergic reaction to something. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, I'm sorry. Like, my arms are, like, all, like, pretty red right now. Your neck is so red right Oh, is it? I yeah, can't tell, like, it doesn't show. So I have my prescribed allergy medicine. Thankfully, I'm not allergic to food. Mm. Okay, I'm going to wash up now. <laughs> all right, we are going to remove our makeup. We feel very gross right now, so it's time to treat ourselves. <laughs> All right, we're gonna start with the cleansing balm. Do you use oil-based cleanser? Yes, I do. Are you gonna just use mine? Yes, please. Yes, please. I wanna be a Joseph Minya. <laughs> this is what it looks like. I love cleansing balms. This one doesn't have a fragrance. For water base, I'm just gonna be using this one from Troyata K. It is time to apply some products. Yes. Okay, Vanity Kit from the hotel. By the way, the hotel is not sponsored. I just <laughs> thought it was fun to like film this at Joseon Hotel. So we have wow. contacts from Joseon. <laughs> Your skin is so nice. What is the secret? This is the bubble toner. I don't think I've. Uh, this is like the first time I've ever tried a bubble toner. Bubble toner? Yeah. Ready? Or. Can you bubble? You gotta. You look at. Bubble gotta spread out. You spread out. You spread out. It applies so well. As much as you want, girl. As much as you want. And then I'm gonna apply the essence. Essence water. Do <laughs> not I love this. This is like one of my favorite products from the. the oh, like it's not when you brought this to, to Jeju. Jeju. I did bring it to Jeju. Yeah, I wanted to use it. Jinseng essence water. Oh, I forgot. Jinseng essence water. Yeah, there's ginseng in here. Oh. 건강한 냄새. I'm gonna use the repair serum. Do you want it? Mm. Okay, I'm gonna you use this one. That's like rice. The yodur manasul tan rice, 진짜 맛있었는데. Ah, rice가 여드름에 좋아. 그 뭐지 brightening 효과가 있어가지고 그 그, it helped with like the hyperpigmentation. I didn't know everything. You know why? Cause I had really bad skin. When <laughs> and I did whatever I I did all the research. Tried so many different products to get rid of acne. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I love this. This has been great. Yogi ginseng and snail mucin. You know? It's because this is my very first time using Jodan Minya products. <laughs> yes, right? first impressions. The first impression about the balm is balm. Like, it's good. <laughs> yeah, because it removes everything so mm. clearly. Yeah, we're giving away the uh, cleansing balm. <gasps> Guys, get the balm. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Yeah, right? Mm. Like, uh, my subscribers were saying that they have really good serums. Mm. Very tired. 
So I'm gonna be using this. <laughs> my hair looks like Gwen's, but step on it. Pushing <laughs> jumping. My knees Gwen. Not chosen. I think on me. Chosen is like that. Mama. I have um, redness, I have melasma, I have freckles, um, but when it comes to skin, it just takes time for you to like really learn about what you like, what works for you, <laughs> unless you're Jen and have perfect skin. Good morning. You know what time it is. This is actually um, a very intense game right now. Let's go, Giannis. left in the game it feels like 30 minutes i feel like you know the sports anchors for the nba the korean ones i feel like if they were walking around the streets of korea and they were just talking i wouldn't know who they are <laughs> i've listened to their voices way too many times i feel like i'll know them and i know their faces too so mm. i would like fangirl <laughs> i'd be like oh my gosh hey i know your voice i know i know you <laughs> all right we're ready to head out. Where are we going, Jen? Shimon's the hippest spot in Hyundai. Yeah, it really is. We got invited, so we're gonna go check out the store, take some photos, grab something to eat, and maybe go to the pool. We don't know yet. We have absolutely no plans. <laughs> She's cheering me up because today Milwaukee lost. It was kind of sad. I'm like sad and you're like happily like <laughs> ah, just kidding, it's okay. It's fine. Series is tied to two. Alright, let's go. Let's go. store but we successfully got our goods I changed for this whole event yes <laughs> let's go get some coffee now oh perfect over the moon thinking of you thinking of you now it is time to treat ourselves to some tteokbokki. Busan is actually known for their tteokbokki. And I think yeah. it's because they're known for their omuk, the, the fish cakes. And so one of the secrets to a good tteokbokki recipe is omuk. Did you know that? Yeah, omuk makes really good water. Yeah, and so we want to try all the tteokbokki. We actually went out of our hotel last night and had some of the best street tteokbokki. Busan's a little different from Seoul. It's open to like midnight or there's no curfew now, right? There's no curfew. Yeah. Which is like awesome. <laughs> so it felt kind of new because yesterday we were roaming around and we had late night snacks. And so, yeah, I didn't vlog that, but we just want all the tteokbokki. <laughs> yeah, that's our, yeah. That's our goal! goal. <laughs> we only go to the ones where there's like a long line for. Oh my. So something we noticed is that in Putan, a lot of the spicy rice cakes 
looks super spicy because look how red this is like that's amazing and they're also very famous for their amul like i said before and jen loves her sundae so we got a lot of everything the owners are super nice he knew that we were from seoul so that he gave us um the oh. salt saying that seoul people likes to eat but there was salt right the busan people eat this with samjang right mm -hmm. I changed back into my CEO t-shirt. I changed because I wanted to take some serious pictures in front of Simone's with the shirt from Simone's. I got this as well as the cap and Jem just changed in to her Simone's t-shirt. Nice. <laughs> I just didn't want to get tteokbokki on my new white shirt because I tend to always ruin white t-shirts whenever um, I eat spicy stuff. So, all right. Let's wait for some plates as well as some forks and eat this. Oh my goodness. This is how we crinkles. I mean, how else would you eat it? In Busan. Our last night in Busan. Busan. And also, we're by the beach. There's a lot of people, though. Wow, a lot of people. Actually. It was so different from yesterday. Yeah. Yesterday we came out a lot later. Maybe that's yeah. why. Yeah. Oh, but the closer you go, it's less people. This is Busan, y'all. I think I'm just terrible when it comes to vlogging during vacation but we came to this really sweet bar called Joseph in Busan. We were walking around and we just saw these beautiful lights and we decided to come on in and I'm having some whiskey. This is on the rocks and Gemma is still working on her first glass of the special sweet drink. And then I can tell you this is alcohol. It is so sweet. And then here I am. I am drinking my fave. Hi everyone. It is time to check on out. I have the game in the background. I'm sorry, Gem, that you have to see this side of me. <laughs> um, let's go, Sans. But yeah, um, it is time to grab something to eat first and then we're gonna go take the KTX back to Seoul. Yeah, this is my outfit of the day. I posted a story of these pants and a lot of you guys were very interested. It's sweatpants in the front, denim on the back. Wait, I think I did this in Seoul, but it's from Style Nanda. I will link it down below. All right, um, let's check on out. It's just a little. Hey, we're training bags. He's cool, right? Cute. I wanted to see this. No! Okay, okay, we're really leaving now. <laughs> you like to roll the remote. We were walking around and there's a line for this place. This wasn't planned, but this is where we're going to eat. It's called Tempura Taiga. We don't even know what kind of food they have. We know it's probably tempura. Japanese. Yeah. place to vlog because they're using all copyright free music. I definitely use this on Jody for sure. Mm. It was so good. Gemma really loved the food. She's wearing it. <laughs> Just in case you guys ask me where the things from. It's DIY. <laughs> DIY. DIY. DIY Dark Victory. <laughs> Jeans. All right, on our way back to Seoul. It looks like San Francisco. It feels like I'm on the Bay Bridge right now. Oh my gosh. Train back to Seoul. 
did it. Okay. We got some donuts, got some hodu gaja, got some golden. everyone we're back in Seoul and it's surprisingly hotter here than Busan and it's supposed to rain starting tomorrow I think so uh, monsoon season is officially here I said this like in a previous vlog but for sure it's about to look very gloomy and feel very sticky and humid it's not my favorite um, but I did want to wrap up the vlog and thank you guys for watching the Busan episode and also thank Beauty of Chosan for treating my skin and I wanted to share my favorite products from the entire line after using it for about a month and a half and I I absolutely love this essence, the ginseng essence water. I tend to love uh, lightweight essences that just quickly absorbs on into my skin, um, but it feels very moisturized afterwards. I feel like sometimes when the product is too watery, it doesn't feel um, instantly moisturized. I feel like I have to really um, layer the product, but I think with one layer, I just saw an instant glow and I really loved the results. And then I would have to say my next favorite would be the Repair Serum. Ginseng and Snail Mucin are two ingredients that I would recommend for people who have acne and acne scars. And uh, surprisingly, this is another serum that I would recommend for people who have acne scars. This is the Glow Deep Serum. Rice is part of the ingredients here. And I really liked how this one felt on my skin. Gem actually really liked it. And so we did use up a lot of it throughout um, but yeah this is actually a serum that I liked right away actually and then the cleansing balm um, I love my cleansing balms especially when I'm wearing heavy makeup and so this is a great cleansing balm that I would recommend. And uh, these two products we are giving away. So if you are interested in trying out these products, check the description box to see how you can enter. And yeah, that wraps up today's episode. I wanna thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you guys next week. Bye, have a joan day.